So when you're opening the range, don't necessarily assume that the person before you put away the trap uh, properly and disarmed it. So as you open the doors, the first thing you always want to do is check and make sure that the throwing arm is in a safe position. And you can see it's in a safe position uh, by the arm being over in the left side of the machine. Uh, and you can see the red arm is out, uh, outstretched off the side of the throwing plate. Uh, if the machine is armed, you'll see a target on the plate and uh, the, the red, red throwing arm will be moved around to the target. So when it's time to check the machine or reload targets, uh, the first thing you want to do before you go down is find the handset controller and take it with you. Okay, this way you're in control of whether or not the microphones are on or off. So you want to make sure that all the voice releases are off uh, so you don't accidentally get a target um, thrown out when you're not expecting it. So as you approach the house, uh, it's a good idea just to leave the controller up here on top until you can get down there. And that way folks up range will know uh, there's something going on. Um, next thing you want to do is just kind of just work your way just around the edge of the door. You want to stay as close to the door as you possibly can as you move in. So I come around here, I find the release switch, which is this first switch here closest to me. Make sure the machine is pointing away from me. I'm going to go ahead and hit the switch. This disarms the machine. The machine is now safe. Okay. And uh, we can load. We can turn the pump motor off if we'd like. Uh, one thing to note is that when the machine's armed, it will not disarm with the pump motor is off. So I'm going to go ahead and arm the machine. Okay, turn the pump motor off. All right, so everything sounds like it's off, but you will notice there is still a target on that plate. All right, so the machine is not safe. And if I try to flip the release switch, nothing happens. So the pump motor has to be on in order to release the machine. So I wanna turn the pump motor on. All right, and then go ahead and hit release. All right, now the machine is safe. Okay, so to make uh, adjustments for manual on the machine, a uh, couple things. First thing we wanna make sure uh, the machine is disarmed before we hit in the house. We wanna make sure uh, that we have our stop sign up and visible so anybody up range knows that uh, the trap is in service. Uh, from here, we can go ahead and get in the trap. Um, and you wanna work, make sure you're working uh, from this very back corner. So come in as far as you can into the house and uh, work from here, all right? This is a safe safe place uh, to be away from the trap, okay? Um, and so when you're working, make sure you're back in the corner. Uh, all the controls for manual are here on the right side of the machine. Uh, you'll see we can drive the machine left or right or up and down. So if you need to make adjustments or if you want to uh, change the machine for training, you can do that. Uh, to make changes, however, the machine must be on and it must be armed. Okay, so you wanna be very, very careful and make sure you're working from right back here on the right rear of the machine the entire time you're making adjustments, okay? Uh, while you're in the house, uh, you've gotta uh, kinda of go back and forth between the, the switches and the manual. Uh, one other important thing, you wanna make sure you bring down the handset controller with you. So if you're adjusting targets, um, you can uh, throw targets from inside the house here uh, without having an assistant. Um, and so if I'm gonna just make a adjustment here to, th to set the trap for straightaways uh, for beginning trap shooters, uh, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn the pump motor on and then the release on. Okay, machine is now armed. Okay, so it's especially important that you stay in the back right corner here while you're working on this. Uh, from here, the next thing I wanna do is make sure I wanna turn the trap to manual. Okay, so you see the machine's turning here back and forth. So we're just gonna flip this switch here to manual, all right? And the machine stops oscillating. All right, so the machine's a little bit positioned to the right, uh, so I need to drive it left. So I'm just gonna uh, reach up here and just push the left button, and just a little push will adjust the machine quite a bit. Uh, so we can test the target here, so I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, again, stay back in the back rear, and I'm gonna take a look at uh, what we've got here. All right, that target 
Still looks a little bit too far right, so I'm going to keep driving it left a little bit more. All right, we'll take another look here. All right, still too far right. I'm going to go left a little bit more. All right, that's about perfect today with the wind, so uh, that's where we want it. So from here again, you want to make sure you take the handset with you and uh, the machines uh, armed so make sure you stay completely at the right side of the house and again we're just going to work our way around the door here uh, we'll go ahead and take the sign down and then we can head up range uh, to start shooting again